Hi, Nelson Ryan again with Southern Light LED. Today we're going to take you through our installation of the um, kicker speakers, six and a half inch, with the JBL head unit combined with our LED Bluetooth RGB controls. These speakers um, have an LED illumination, changes different colors, shades, whatever you want. Um, first off, what we're going to do is we prefer, you can use a jigsaw, this is a whole lot easier. This is our four inch hole saw. We pre-marked our holes and what we did is measure the distance between the front, halved it, then half that, and then came down and measured the middle, put a center point, put our drill bit right there in the dead center. Drilled these holes out, makes it real easy, fast, and we are going to install these speakers next, right here. And we have our speaker wire. Went ahead and put our terminals on our speaker wire. So it's ready to plug straight in to our speakers, just like that. And we'll use an isolator to separate them to keep any noise out of the radio. Great thing about this edge boat that we're doing this build on, they pre-ran a cord in here with a hole. This cord runs all the way to the stern of the boat. So what we'll do is we have our two speakers here. We'll connect our wires to the speakers, use this cord, pull the speaker wire all the way to the back where we need it to our head unit and everything will be underneath the hole, never have to worry about something hitting or pulling on it or anything. So we'll show you how that goes and we'll get started. Next, what we're gonna do is mount our speakers. We're gonna use a self-drilling bit, screw, and we're gonna turn all these wires, make sure they're down, run them through the hole, make sure they're down again before you stick it in. Put this in there with the cover. And then we're gonna make sure you have your screw holes. Make sure they're parallel across or it uh, looks correct before you screw it down because you don't wanna have a lot of holes in your boat. Once that's in there, take your screw. Get back and look at it one more time. Self-drilling screw. And repeat the process all the way down. We're gonna get both of these speakers up front installed. Okay, we got both our Speakers installed securely, screwed down just how we wanted them. We're going to go inside here and we're going to connect the wires to the back of the speakers, run them through up underneath our hole or our floor and install our head unit and our two speakers in the rear and show you those steps next. Take our speaker wire and we're going to use the one that has the writing on it as our positive. So we'll find the one that has the writing and plug it in with our spade terminals we already connected to our speaker wire. Then we'll take this isolator noise reducer, feedback reducer. It came with the system. Snap it on and take a zip tie and run it through there and zip tie it and that'll keep it static free or any kind of feedback from any of the other wiring in the boat. Next we're gonna run these down through the hole, feed them back to the stern. Take our string that goes to our stern, 
that's up here in the bow. We're going to take our two wires from our front left and right speaker, take some electrical tape, and run it around it. Run it all the way to the end and then back down it pretty good. That way it doesn't pull loose when you're pulling it. Kind of make the front to a point so it'll slide through real easy. And we're gonna go back to the stern and start pulling it and pull these wires all the way to the back. Okay, we got our string coming out the stern. We're gonna slowly pull the wires down through making sure they don't get hung up on anything. And there we go. We got our wires coming out the back. Okay, next what we're gonna do is connect the RGB, the LED lights to the speakers. The speakers came with these two plugs or Two speakers in the front are close proximity of each other so what we're going to do is wire these two plugs together you want to connect blue to blue green to green red to red black to black and that'll give us our RGB and a uh, positive so what you're going to do is take these two wires connect these we got our RGB wire that we're going to run back to our RGB controller for our speaker so we can change the colors and make it do whatever we want. So we're going to connect these four wires to these and solder them together with shrink and everything and I'll show you how we do that. You're ready to go. We'll go plug this in and run this to the back to the head unit. We've got our splice we did here. We're going to take it from one speaker and we're going to plug it in just like that. And from the other speaker, plug it in. Once that's plugged in, we're going to take this wire with our rope coming from the back and run this all the way to the stern. Okay next before we install these rear speakers we're going to install our head unit. We're going to mount it right here. Previous boat this was a good location. Um, you're not having to fumble for it. You can just look down, read the screen, hit your buttons while you're driving. Real easy to access right here. Doesn't affect you seating, sitting down. So we'll put it right here. Take our hole saw, hopefully not drill through the outside of the boat. Put it about right there. That's how you do it. I'm gonna take this sure it fits. This is our power wire. What we did is we went ahead and soldered our power wire, wire longer to where we can get to our switch panel. So we're going to put all that in there. Like that. 
Hold up girl, don't you know you're beautiful And I see 